opposed to when they spend on others. And what they found in this particular journal, a recent study, they found that when you spend on others, you have a 40% higher happiness rate than when you spend on yourself. It's quite an interesting thing. What this study searched after was, how do you attain this concept of happiness through spending? And 40% increase when you spend on others. And that's what Ramadan is about. It's about introspection. It's about thinking about others and spending about others when the time comes. The whole month of Ramadan is meant to prepare the individual to take a really deep look at oneself as to who you are, what the purpose of life is all about. Not just to live a life, but to live a fulfilled, purposeful life where you think about others. One thing that was interesting in this study, what they found is most people that they work for all their lives, but most of the money that they work for will actually not be theirs. It'll be given to their offspring and those that come after. So the most of the money that you actually earn and work for in your life is not actually wealth that you would spend in your lifetime. So Rabbi is such an interesting facet and an interesting component about giving back. Not only about living a life whereby the comforts and those surrounding things that you know might make us happy and give us a temporary moment of enjoyment, but rather the enjoyment is bringing a smile to the faces of others, of others, enriching the lives of others, making the lives of others enriched and enhanced, given opportunity. That's what the spirit of Eid is about. It's about reflection. It's about looking at oneself, improving one's life, but also how can I be of benefit to others? My last word will be this. There are three types of people that exist in this world. The first type of person that exists in this world is the person that when you cross paths with them, you leave them and they leave you in a neutral state. You've done no harm. The second type of person that exists in this world is the person that when you part ways, you've left them enriched. So this is the second type of uh, individual that enriches the life of others. The third type of category or the third category of people that exist in this world is that you put yourself out there for others, that you see people that they're in dire need and you make some sacrifices to their lives, to improving their lives in some way, wherever you can, even if it's in a smile. And tonight, and we'll speak a, bit, little bit, a little bit about this later, about that third category, about putting oneself out there to enrich the life of others. So I hope today we can celebrate this idea about being there for others, enriching the life of others, putting ourselves out there for others. So life is not only good for us, but also good for those whose lives are less fortunate. That is the spirit of Eid, but that is also the spirit of the month of Ramadan, which is not only about feasting, but also about finding oneself in this world and bringing purpose to one's life. That's really what Ramadan is about. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, and distinguished guests. And this is a beautiful and momentous occasion. Hopefully we can have this great in the Hey, school. Zafi Piri Piri Lalo. Ubatna Zafi Fla, Ahla Azifur, La Hoblo!
to the dark Hide away, they say We don't want your broken parts When the sharpest words are what have cut me down When I'm hurt, when I'm down and bound I am brave, I am bruised, I am who I meant to be This is me, I don't run no bullets in my skin I'm far away, cause I feel I won't let the shit see We are bursting through the land We are glorious When the shop is open It's gonna cut me down I'm gonna send a flood Gonna drown it out I am blue I am blue I am blue I am blue I'm gonna send a flood, gonna draw them out I am blue, I am bruised, I am who I meant to be This is me, this is me, cause you are first And I'm watching all to the beat I draw I'm about to be, this is me, I'm here to be a part of you
much for coming tonight. It really means a lot. It's great to see the Granville community live and in action. And I'm so proud to be one of the teachers here. So we're going to go through while we wait for all the logistics. We've got Mr. Matai. Give a hand to Mr. Matai. And across to our Granville South, um, brothers and sisters over there, we've got Wallow, Mr. Wallow the Mal. Uh, we've got my younger sister, who's helping us out. So go ahead. We've also got Miss Hoogie on the keys. Um, our boss who allows us to have our leave, our sick leave and everything, Mr. Abraham. Give a round of applause. And then we also have the master behind the stage, Mr. Hoblos on drums. Yeah. 